All right, y'all. So, Mr. Andy Langan is running a little bit late at work today, so I'm gonna meet him at the movie theater, and maybe we'll do a, a spoiler review of afterwards. But I wanted just to talk a few topics with you guys on Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness, right? And I wanted to ask you guys in the audience a couple questions, what you guys think. Do we think, you know, based on uh, Doctor Strange 1, do we think we're going to see Dormammu in Doctor Strange 2? I mean, I'd probably, I honestly have no idea what to expect. I'm going to go with no for that, right? I really want to see a Tony Stark variant. Um, that would be wonderful. I don't think we're going to. If we do, I mean, spoiler, spoiler, kind of not spoiler. Uh, I heard, there was rumors going around that Superior Iron Man is going to be played by, uh, what's, in, what's his name? By the Mission Impossible guy. Um, God, he's famous. How, did I, how am I going to blank on this guy's name? Tom Cruise. There it is. Um, played by Tom Cruise, and honestly, I don't really want that. I would honestly love to see Robert Downey Jr. back, but I don't think we're going to get that either. So, I don't think we're going to see that. Do we see Loki or Sylvie in this? Or Kang from, you know, the Loki TV series? I don't know, maybe. I mean, maybe they're just leaving that stuff in Doctor Strange. Or maybe that they're leaving that stuff for Loki Season 2. But, man, oh man, would I love to see Loki... Um, I would love to see Thor, but I think that's going to be also a no-go. We're going to see Thor in Thor Love and Thunder. I mean, it's a multiverse, though, so we could see potentially an infinite number of anybody. You know, so I think we're getting at least four, I've heard, Doctor Strange variants. I think even more than that. Um, do we think we see Deadpool? I don't know. Deadpool's fucking awesome. I love Ryan Reynolds. So maybe this is how we introduce him into the MCU. And then maybe he gets his own mo movie branching from here. But I, that would be one I'd love to see. We know we're getting um, Sir Patrick Stewart back as as Professor X. I mean, Hugh Jackman's my guy. The, that Wolverine character was one of my first, you know, favorite superhero characters. And he's a stud. So... I would love to see Hugh Jackman back. That's This is my prediction for this movie, that we get Hugh Jackman back and he's wearing the yellow, like, Origins costume, like the real, you know, authentic Wolverine costume. That would make my entire day. Do we get Kevin Feige in this? Is Kevin Feige a variant of somebody? Is he himself in this movie? Probably not. I would love that. Love Kevin Feige. He's the man. Praise Kevin. In Kevin we trust. Oh, man. So, there's a lot. There's a lot, man. There's a lot that we can talk about. But I think mostly we need to just talk about Wanda, Doctor Strange. Maybe will we see Vision? I don't know. Comment below. Let me know what you guys think. Um, I'm going to be heading over to that the theater soon. So, I just wanted to touch base with you guys. Because it's probably, I was like, why not, why not film it before I start driving so I don't have to... <laughs> I don't have to, sh you know, multitask, drive in, fucking film. Fuck that. <laughs> and so, I'll be heading over there shortly, and maybe I'll get Langone's thoughts and my thoughts of the movie afterwards. We'll talk full spoilers for that. This is just predictions and talking what my expectations are and what I think of this movie and what my expectations are and what my guesses are and... I I just think it's going to be insane, you know, like, friggin' Sam Raimi and just how he makes films. I loved the first three Spider-Man films. I'm sure he's made other things too, but I'm just blanking on the titles and stuff right now, so I'm sure I've seen other movies that he's made, but if if the first three Spider-Men are the only things I have to go off of, I'm a fan of them, so... I've And he's going to be... There, he's trying to make this real horror film, so... I'm not a real horror film fan, so, you know, and to mix horror with Marvel and Doctor Strange and just Benedict Cumberbatch and everything that they can do, it's going to be wild. And it, it's supposed to be madness, so maybe my mind will be blown. Maybe I won't even be able to talk to you guys about this tonight. I'll be, just be so lost for words. 
I'll have to sleep on it or something. So maybe I'll see you guys tomorrow and talk about it, but I can't wait, baby. I'm hitting the road very shortly here. And uh, yeah, so hit that thumbs up for me, guys. Smash that subscribe button. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and whatever else you want to follow me on. My links are in the uh, description below. And uh, it's time, baby. It's time for Multiverse of Madness. I cannot fucking wait. Follow Lang Langone, too. I'm going to put his links down below. Can't send him a congratulations for his baby. His little bouncing baby girl. She'll be here very shortly. Not here yet, but she'll be here. And, uh, yeah. I'll see you guys then, because I think he's messaging me saying he's on his way, so I'm going to hit the road, too. I'll see you guys. It will be one second for you. It will be many hours for me. <laughs> Probably two, maybe three. I don't know how long this movie is. But I think it's only like two hours and something minutes. But either way, we're, it's going to be a couple hours for me. It's going to be one second for you guys. And it might even be dark. So I'm sorry right now for the, the lighting quality. But I'm going to do the best I can for nighttime in New England. So, yeah. I can't wait, baby. Doctor Strange time. Let's go. I'll see you guys there.